Hi, Yarnabies. It's me, Sandy. Um, I don't even know where to start. Excuse my appearance. I just got out of the shower. Um, I know where to start. I would like to say a huge, huge thank you to all of you. Um, especially the Oh, content creators that have been posting for me um, and keeping you guys all updated uh, with what's going on. Thank you, Sandy. Thank you, Petra. Thank, thank you. Thank you, all of you. Um, <clears throat> uh, the other thing is I would love to thank all of the... I'm not going to say subscribers, you are all my friends, um, I just want to say thank you for all of your well wishes and all of your prayers. Um, <clears throat> I would like to say a massive thank you to all of you who have put in donations. It is going to a really good cause. Um, it is, it's really hard for our family to be going back and forth. Um, it takes an hour and a half for me to get to my sister. Um, and it takes a while for my brother-in-law to get there too. He's trying to work a, uh, a little bit just to keep his mind, yeah, <laughs> just to keep his mind. Um, but <clears throat> the one thing that my sister, when she's coherent, when she's actually um, able to communicate the first thing she says is are you guys taking care of Dan and we keep telling her yes we're, we're he's fine he's gonna be okay you know he's not but <clears throat> we tell her she that he is um, and then the second thing is you know bring me my ledger book I need to make sure our bills are all paid and our I need to make sure that everything's in order and we keep telling her that my niece Michelle is taking care of it and we're trying to take the load off her but she is so focused on she's not focused on herself and what's happening to her she's focused on everybody else and and what's happening at home um, and it doesn't matter how many times we tell her to just relax and heal She's just laser focused on um, what needs to be done. <clears throat> and then we, <clears throat> excuse me, and then we have the conversation over and over and over again because she has um, short term uh, memory issues. So when her, the fluid builds up in her brain, um, she becomes incoherent again and um, you can't have a conversation with her and then when it gets really bad she's non-responsive um, the good news is is that with the last surgery that she had she pulled through it really well um, my niece just told me that they took the stint out of her head um, yesterday so the pressure in her brain is good. Uh, it, the, they unclogged the tubing um, in the base of her brain, so now everything's flowing naturally. So that's, that's a blessing in itself. So hopefully <clears throat> that means that she will be cognizant all the time. Um, they told her 
yesterday that she has cancer. Um, she's in denial. She's waiting for the biopsy results. She's always positive. She's She is a fighter. She's a lot stronger than we are. A lot stronger. <clears throat> um, anyway. So this is my plan. Uh, <clears throat> once they tell us the results of the biopsy and what kind of cancer it is, they are going to send her to the cancer ward. So, <clears throat> um, I'm getting so many messages, um, asking how they can, how people can help, um, and so this is what I'm, I'm thinking of doing. <clears throat> As Sandy from Left is Right told you, I, I'm not going to, I don't know if I'm going to do the GoFundMe. I, I just don't know. I don't know if I have the brain capacity to try and figure it out. So I do have um, an email address that if you would like to donate, even if it's like $2, $5, whatever, it would so be appreciated, but I'm not pressuring anybody. Um, I'm leaving that to your discretion. The email is mskitty1111 at gmail.com. It's mskitty1111 at gmail.com. I'll leave that here. Uh, and I will have it in the description box below. For those of you that that can't donate, um, I, I had this idea that if you would like to um, send a well wishes card to my address, my P PO box, it's also down below, and maybe crochet a heart or an angel, uh, just like a little ornament and pop that in the envelope and what I would like to do is make a garland um, to put in my sister's room at the cancer ward. I want to try and surround her with as much love as I can visually and physically. Um, <clears throat> so uh, yeah, I would like to have hearts and angels and, and everything that she can look at and what I want to do is for, for all the hearts and angels that come in, I'm going to have a little piece of paper taped to it, um, hanging with your name on it, so that my sister knows that all of my Yarny family is with her. Um, so I thought that would be, you know, really special. Uh, so if you would like to do that, that would, that would be wonderful just wonderful um, <clears throat> also what I'm planning on doing is for those of you that I mean I'm, I'm sure oh God, I can't even talk guys I'm sorry I'm I'm probably babbling and probably not making much sense I can't tell anymore um, the cardigans that I'm making uh, I'm going to be selling so if any of you are interested in any of the cardigans, um, let me know, email me. And those cardigans, whatever uh, cardigans sell, I'm going to be giving that money to my sister. Well, to my niece, <laughs> to take care of the bills and to take care of everything so that my sister doesn't have to worry. Um, she does not know what I'm doing. She doesn't know about the donations and I'm not going to tell her uh, until she's really better. 
and I hope um, because she's a very prideful woman um, she doesn't she, she doesn't ask for anything ever um, even if it's putting you know a bit of gas in her car because she took me to the mall or or whatever um, she won't take my money <laughs> Uh, whenever she comes to visit me and we go to the mall or the movies or whatever, she's always trying to give me something for gas, even though she can't afford it. And I keep telling her, no, you're like, what are you doing? I'm your sister, you know, and she's like, no, you're taking it. And I'm just, and it's a, it's a battle. <laughs> so she's, um, she's very prideful. She doesn't, um, Yeah, she never she never asks for help. Um, she'd rather go down with the ship than ask for help. You know what I mean? Like she's just stubborn, but she get, comes by it honestly. Um, so yeah, so I I'm I'm gonna I've written down all the names of the people that have donated. I've written down your email addresses and we will be sending out thank you cards. Um, so, yeah. Uh, sorry, I'm just trying to um, trying to get my thoughts straight here. I know there was a bunch of stuff I wanted to talk to you guys about. And it's just... <laughs> um, I'm crocheting like crazy. My finger is just killing me right now because I, I'm, I think I have arthritis in this finger. I, I don't know, but it really hurts. <laughs> um, I got yarn in. Um, I got a whole bunch of the... Um, uh, <laughs> anyways, I got yarn in. Um, for the, the blanket that I'm <laughs> trying to make <clears throat> for Sandy at Left is Right Crochet. We're doing the adventure blanket. Uh, I tried doing it. <clears throat> My sister was in surgery for almost seven hours. <sighs> Longest seven hours ever. Um, and I was trying to keep my mind focused on something else. So I have my niece she was crocheting a granny square blanket. I had her best friend on the other side playing uh, on her, playing games on her iPad. And then I was trying to focus on the bean stitch. Epic fail. <laughs> and I was doing it with white yarn. White is almost as bad as black. It, it melded all together. I couldn't see what I was doing. I just... I had to frog it, um, so I don't think I'll be doing that again. <laughs> uh, what else? Yeah, I will put up pictures of the cardigans, um, and if you're interested, yeah, email me at um, crochetacanada at gmail dot com. Um, I don't know what else to say, guys. I I'm just thank you so, so, so much. Thank you. Um, I Oh, I, I am um, trying to watch videos. I am getting messages from those videos. Uh, and I'm trying to keep <coughs> keep up to date on everybody's content um, but <clears throat> it can be hard at times but it does keep my mind uh, active because I'm kind of numb right now I uh, yeah I'm numb I'm lost I'm I know I'm in pain uh, 
mental and spiritual. But, um, uh, oh, my foot. <clears throat> I drove for the first time. I'm not supposed to drive. <laughs> but I had to go down to Victoria. George was working. Uh, it didn't, it went okay. Um, I kind of suffered more after, like, yesterday. Uh, my foot was pretty sore. I'm walking really weird. I don't know. Um, like I said before, it's almost like I have a twisted ankle all the time. Um, <clears throat> I don't know why this surgery has affected my ankle so bad. Maybe it's, it's because I'm walking different. But uh, I don't like it. <laughs> it hurts. So uh, I'll be getting x-rays. In February, I think. Yeah. Oh, God. It's the end of the month, isn't it? Today's the 30th. Wow, I can't believe I actually know the date. That's something new. Oh, it's because I had a bill come out today. <laughs> That's why. Oh, God, help me. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so I'll be getting x-rays and I'll be finding out what's going on. Um, but everything seems to be okay, I think. Anyways, guys, I'm going to go because now I'm just going to start rambling aimlessly. So just know that I am getting all of your messages. Um, I am feeling all of your love. And I appreciate it immensely. Words cannot express what it means and how I feel. Um, eventually I will be doing a video with my niece. Uh, she would like to say her own thanks. And, um, my brother-in-law, he's just, he's a mess. Uh, I doubt very much I'll be able to get him on camera. He's not that kind of guy. Um, but anyways, I thought that maybe you guys would like to see who you're donating to and who you're praying for. So I'm going to leave some photos of my sister at the end of this video. Okay. So I love you all. I give you guys, as Sandy says, I give you big hugs. I cannot kiss you guys enough. I, I really can't. Um, so yeah. So I will talk to you guys as soon as I can. And I will try and keep you, now that I've got my head on a little bit better, I can, I can give you guys updates <clears throat> from this point on, I think. Unless something terribly goes wrong. I'm hoping not. Everything should be going tickety-boo. I hope. Um, okay, so I love you all. Mwah. And I will talk to you soon. Thanks. Mm -hmm.